So, you recently performed at this year's Olympics, the closing ceremony. What was that like for you? Oh, performing at the Olympics was amazing. The experience, and it was overwhelming. The amount of people as we walked out onto the stage, it was crazy. Such good fun. And obviously it was a good um, Olympics, it's been amazing for gymnastics and highlighting the sports. It did really well, yeah, so that was yeah. fantastic. Did you watch much of the Olympics? The I tried to watch as much as I could around training, because obviously we're in training every night, but I ma managed to watch quite a bit. So seeing Beth Tweddle and the boys win medals was great. Yeah. Fantastic. How many how many hours a week would you say that you guys train at school? Uh, normally it's about 18 hours a week um, we train, so that's for our competitions. But then if we have extra shows, then it's extra few hours we have to put in over the weekend or in the evening. So, so you're going to be performing at the Royal Variety. How are you feeling about that? Are you feeling excited now? Um, I'm really excited to perform at the Royal Variety, obviously in front of all the royals and getting to meet the other celebrities, but I'll be a bit nervous on the day, definitely. Now you mentioned the Queen is actually there this time. and She's going to be watching our lovely Lizzy. Um, she's had a big year as well, it's been her jubilee. Yeah, yeah. So have you been practicing your curtsy? I haven't practiced my curtsy yet for the Queen. I suppose I'll have to do that Would in the next Would you like to give week? us the first yeah. ever practice of your curtsy? Oh, fantastic. <laughs> Better than anything I could pull yeah. together. Lovely. Hopefully the Queen will appreciate it. <laughs> fantastic. Now, this year you're teaming up with Diversity. What can we expect from that performance? Uh, well, they tried teaching us a few of their moves. I'm not sure how well that went down. Um, trying to learn diversity sort of dance is quite difficult for us. Um, and diversity have been learning a few of our moves as well. So it's a real collaboration between the two groups. So we've joined together instead of doing two separate things. We've all come together as one. Fantastic. So, yeah, what diversity really good. like as a group? I know as a female, I find them pretty hot. Do you find them pretty hot? Stuff? Yeah, Ashley Banjo is very nice to look at. <laughs> <laughs> um, but no, they're all great fun. They always having a laugh, diversity, always joking around. So it's really nice for us where we train quite seriously and then getting to go with them is really good fun. Brilliant. Now, Spellbound are obviously one of the biggest sort of um, gymnastic troops that we know um, yeah. as of acrobatics. Do you feel the pressure that each performance has to sort of be better and better? Uh, yeah, it does, definitely. The pressure each time, you know people are out there watching and they've watched pre previous performances and they know what to expect, so definitely where things can go wrong, we know the pressure's on every time. Do you think this performance is going to be the best ever yet? Yeah, definitely. This performance, there are big things to come. Fantastic. <laughs> what do you see for the future of Spellbound? In 10 years' time, what do you think the brands of Spellbound will be? I think in the future, Spellbound will continue with new gymnasts, new generations coming in. It's always going to be around and things are always evolving. So, Fantastic. Are there any big moves that you've got that you're working towards? Sort of any big... Um, we're always sort of aiming to improve our moves, sort of making more somersaults, more height, more more twisting, so... Fantastic. Yeah. Can you give us a little... Now we've got all the questions here and we've sort of seen you performing, which is absolutely incredible. Tell us, is there any inside gossip you can give us into the Spellbound, the world of Spellbound? <laughs> is there a fact inside that we might gossip. not know, however weird or random it is? Um, I can't really think, no. <laughs> yeah, any weird, strange facts? Someone um, eat bananas constantly, or...? Well, the boys are always eating. The boys are always up for freebies. Any free food, if there's free food out, the boys are straight in there. Ah, so they'll be hoovering up the Queen's buffet. Oh, definitely, yeah. The yeah. boys will be straight in there. Before the Queen, probably. So sorry, Queen, if she doesn't have anything left to eat. <laughs> It'll be the Spellbound boys. The Spellbound boys, not the girls. Okay. <laughs> Lovely, okay. And what would you say has been your top moment while you've been in um, In Spellbound, definitely was performing the, at, the, at the Olympics. Um, I don't think anything could ever top that the amount the amount of people watching at the olympics is crazy um, so yeah definitely definitely the olympics